Hello, my name is Alan Peck. I'm the head of the family law team here at Tollers. I'm often asked the same questions with regards to divorce proceedings and I thought that it might be helpful if I gave the answers to those questions. The first question that is asked of me is, does it make a difference as to who brings the divorce proceedings when deciding upon the division of the assets of the marriage? The answer to that is no, it makes no difference at all. Therefore, if you're the person being divorced, it matters not, it will not change the question of how the assets of the marriage are going to be divided. Another question that is often asked is whether a divorce can be stopped indefinitely. Uh, the answer to that is that no, after five years separation, a person can bring a divorce based on five years separation and save in the most exceptional circumstances, a divorce is going to be granted. It does therefore mean that even if there's been no fault on the part of a person, they can be divorced and even if they have a religious objection to the divorce, it can still be granted. Another question that is asked is whether if a person forms a relationship with someone, after, someone else after separation, does it amount to adultery? The answer to that is it possibly could be. Even if a relationship is formed after separation, whether it be a month or years later, it could amount to adultery and it could be the basis of a divorce on the fact of adultery. If you have any further questions, please do not hes hesitate to telephone me or email me or come and, and see me. Thank you for your interest.